gonna do the Art of Bouncing nine and come over to my app. I get it going on that indoor run. So let's start. We'll do our base set um, kind of moves, um, but for the warm up. Let's just do kitty corners while we're on the, um, still on the mat. Move your arms. Don't have to come out as wide. <clears throat> Keep moving the arms, that's the whole point of this. Two, now um, metal up your cardio. I'm doubling it now, I don't know. So. Let's double that. <clears throat> what was that beat of that music? Now single it. Now let's bring it together back and forth. go. So what we're going to start by doing is taking that left foot, we're going to tap it around, and then three. Forward, stop your back. I love bouncing to the beat of the music when I have better music. Um, so, sometimes that just kicks in for me. <clears throat> I used to teach up to seven classes a day, Monday through Thursday. And um, that was a lot. And then Fridays I taught four, and I went in on Saturdays and taught three. So, that's a lot of classes. I had to come up with a lot of different ways Three more. Okay. Now I'm going to do the other side. And then we're going to start right away. And with the, um, what we kind of left off with on the last video. See? This is when you want to start changing when the beat changes. Five more. All right, now we're gonna start. I mean, we haven't, we've been bouncing, not quite <laughs> three minutes, but pretty close. So what we're gonna do, we did the one move where we crossed like that. So um, we're gonna add to that a little bit. But I want to start out by um, doing it together, um, left, and then um, the right. I count down, and we're going to single it. When I get to one, we're going to go five, four, three, two, one. Down. I'm not going to go super high with it. We just start it. <clears throat> Cross your arms a little bit. I'm not going to go super high. Yeah. Ten more. Okay. Now let's bring your feet up. Do a little bit. Just a tiny air drop to start. So I'm gonna do right over left. Bring your arms back. Bring them back. Ten more. Okay, now I'm gonna take your right here and then left back. 
Five, four, three, two, one. And bring it back. I'm just crossing. Very minimal to start. Get your muscles all warmed up and raring to go. <clears throat> Do about 12 more. All right, now we're going to do. Um, I'm going to go into um, crossing um, your left in front of your right with the um, air jack. Okay? So we're going back and forth. Remember, I always have to remind you, I'm crunching. Crunching. Here. And, um, here. What a nice alert. All right. So we're going to bounce twice in the middle, but um, we're going to come out, cross left over right, and then bounce twice and then do it again. Okay, we're gonna start by coming out. Five, four, three, two, one. Ah, I messed up. All right, I'm not gonna do the one, two, threes because that makes it harder. <laughs> Too much thinking. So we're gonna do it, just do it. I think you can do it. This is day nine. Um, I don't think you need the one, two, threes at all anymore. So, I'm gonna start over. We're gonna go over and then cross. <clears throat> Five, four, three, two, one. Actually, we're crossing first. <laughs> crossing and then we're gonna bring them out. <clears throat> cross your feet. I haven't done in a while, so bring it back into my hat. Get back into that 63 year old memory. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> and 10 more. Okay, now <clears throat> we'll get that bounce in the center. That's what I was thinking about earlier. So we're going to. Come out, bounce here, out, bounce. Here we go. Here we go. Cross it. Cross your legs. <clears throat> what do you want to do with your arms? Start bringing them out. Get that little cross. Cross them. Bring them up. <clears throat> Ten more. Two more. You got it. Keep 
going. And go from one to the other. Fifteen more. Just want to keep the cardio going up, making sure we're going to get that three miles. Okay. Now we did the move, so I'm going to cross on the opposite side and. I cross left over right. Now, I'm gonna cross right over left. I'm gonna count down from five, hit one, start crossing. Okay? Here we go, five, four, three, two. Cross them. <clears throat> I don't wanna go too high. Got my iPad set up different a little bit, but I might cut my head off a little bit. <laughs> That's okay. As long as you can see the rest of me, you don't have to see my head. <clears throat> Keep moving this. Ten more. Okay. Now, I'm going to do all out air jacks first. And then we're gonna do the one where we come out this. <clears throat> I'm gonna count down from five. And I really want you to either, you can do this. That's what I do in my classes when everybody's pretty warm and you're really sweating and until everybody, that's when you are your own fan. But I tend to come up like this. Okay, five, four, three, I'm not going to come up this high. If I get cut off, it's okay. Bring it. <clears throat> Out. I keep my feet flexed. Now we're going to do kind of mess with your feet too. <laughs> Different foot positions. Changes to the move up. Bring it up. This is kind of another in between move. Bring them up. Here we go. Ten more. It's not your height as much as getting your legs out. All right. So we did this. Now. We're gonna come out like this. Okay. Remember, we do a little bit of this too, so that you're crunching. Always be aware of your core, always, unless you're sleeping. Hold that baby in, tighten it up, do some tucks, a lot of things you can do. All right, so I'm gonna count down from five. When I hit one, we're gonna go out and cross the right over the left. <clears throat> Five, four, three, two, one. Oh, I'm doing it wrong. That's okay. Cross it. Maybe I'm not. Let's just do it up this way on this side. Same way. Cross it. Cross it. Come out. Keep moving up. Come out. Good to do. Ten more. seconds for half. So, um, I'm going to 
take your right knee over now. This is where you're really gonna, I want you to get in the core here and just top like that. That's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna start counting down. Hit one, I want everyone to come over. Five, four, three, two, one. to bring your knee up super high but it's this little bit of a twisting that we're gonna do Keep up crunch it crunching over to the left and stretching out the right here I want to see those Little oblique lines. Over. Keep moving up. Okay, we're gonna do about 10 more. Push it. Whew. You did really well with that. Okay. Um, We're gonna kind of go back to this move where you're crossing this way, like this, but we're gonna come up higher. So let's practice that. A little bit of crunching, make sure we're getting the crunching in. Um, um, so it's gonna be, I'm gonna start introducing real soon the tuck jumps and frog jumps and that kind of stuff. So this is a good, um, preclude to that. So, um, when you're gonna do it, you're gonna, we're gonna bounce for three on it, just so that, but when we do a top jump, and my cross, it's, I'm not gonna come as high as normal, but it's like that. So, I want you to get that top in it. So I'm heavy on this view. And when I count down and I get to five, I mean to one, you're gonna take your left leg and then cross it. Now, so I'm not gonna go as high because we haven't done the top jumps, but it kind of goes with what we've been doing. So get ready, left goes over, and you're not gonna come up super high in that top jump. Five, four, three, two, one. One, two, three. Cross it. Get a little tuck in there. Like you're gonna go across your legs. And you can lean forward, really get that tuck in. Maybe the next video we'll do more of the tuck jumps. This is a tough jump, but I'm not coming up super high yet. I want to get used to that. We just hit our second mile. <clears throat> We're doing great. Still got about 12 minutes left. I'm gonna do 10 more of these. side to side. When I start counting, you can go to the right and then the left. We're not going to count in between. Five, four, three, two, one. Crunch it. You don't have to go super high. It's 
See, I crunch, pick my hip up. Now we're getting into a little bit more advanced. I hope to finish at least the last half all super advanced. And then we will. Moving on, go. 10 more to each side. Crunch it over. Three more. There. That was our little break in between. <laughs> um, um, we are at 2.24 miles and so we're definitely going to get over three. All right, so it's this move. Now I'm practicing this tuck. See it's kind of, you can see it better, but when you come forward, remember we're not going to tuck real high, but you're going to come up. Um, by picking that right leg up and then crossing it. But I'm going to add a little tuck to it. And I'm going to do it um, with three bounces in between. Um, just so that you can get used to it. So when I count down, I get to one, you're going to pick up right away, right, and crunch down to it. <clears throat> Take a deep breath in, go out. Another one. Wait till this. Here we go. Five, four, three, two, one. I did four. One. I did add an extra bow from here. Crunch it. Try to really cross it. See how I cross it. But tuck it. I want to see how I cross that right over. I want you to see the side of your two. So you're tucking it. Now I'm coming up a little bit higher. So I'll keep it down. And I'm going to show you how we do a few other moves by um, pointing your toes. Trying to refresh 
refresh my own memory here. I do a lot of my classes now are with the TRX, and um, we very rarely do a lot of bouncing um, like this. I still throw it in there once a month or so. Um, so that's where I'm getting my memory. So your legs are apart and we're just going to cross like this. Again, like this. Cross them, point them, point the toes. I got so many moves with the TRX and bouncing off. Oh, oh my gosh. I'd love to do that again for YouTube, but we'll see. Not many people have the TRXs. Cross it, come out. Other side again. Cross it. Point them. Say, don't tell me we got. No, almost. You're almost there. Okay. What we're gonna do is out and out and cross. Point out, cross them. Bring them up. Just went into it. My head's gonna get cut off. I don't care. Oh. Point them though when you cross them. Bring them out. Bring them out. Ten more. Cross. right over left and then do an air. We're gonna start crossing when I hit five. I mean one, five, four, three, two, one. I'm gonna do it this way. Keep switching it up. Pointing, not pointing. Flex out, point down. Pointing down, flexing out. Out. I think we just hit our third mile. All right, right here, 10. jogging, I got a low bounce. I haven't even got to that yet. <laughs> so bring them up. 
Remember, we're gonna do a few more. Down. Bring it down. One more. Start bringing it up. Down. March it out. I think that low bounce that I do is one of the hardest ones and super hard if you do it right. So it sounds like it's not hard, <laughs> but it is. Very challenging. Come forward, walk it back. So here we go. Now bring it out. Bring it in. Roll low. Bring it in. It's hard for me to stop. And bring it in. One more up. Okay, that's gonna be it for day nine. One more video and we'll be a third of the way through. And you should be really learning a lot. And I am shutting, shutting mine off. And um, it's just gonna get better from here. Um, and this is really challenging in a different way, but um, when I do the bounce challenge for a beginner, um, I do get a little bit more steps in, but I work 10 times as hard. So um, that's, what, that's what your goal should be, and I use more of my muscle. So um, that's the beauty of it, how, how you're gonna bounce, depending on what level you're at, and um, just switching it up. And I'll be making more and more videos, so I hope you keep following me, and I hope you have a great day.